This is our second sunrise flow of the 30-day morning yoga journey. I like to make my sunrise flows more of a vinyasa flow nature, flowing one breath per movement to awaken our body by uniting our body and breath through movement. Now you can access the complete 30 days for free if you'd like by visiting the link in the description below and entering the promo code that's on the screen now. All right, my friend, Johnny and I will join you seated on the mat. Our second sunrise flow of this series. Let's begin by making our way to the back of the mat, sitting your hips to your heels. We'll take a big, beautiful breath in as you lift your heart to the morning sky, sweeping your fingertips up, big stretch. Palms kiss and lower to heart center. With palms kissing at heart center, let's set an intention of what you would like to cultivate here on the mat this morning that you would like to flow with you off the mat and into your day. Maybe just one word or a sentence or two. your next inhale breathe in circling your fingertips to the sky breathing in and gathering vibes of your intention palms kiss and bring it all down to your heart center again breathe in circle fingertips up your nose tracing along with your hands as you lift exhale cactus your arms wide side to side as you lower them down breathe in circle them right back up awakening our arms exhalation arms cactus elbows reach back as you lower down Breathe in, just circle up, nose tracing along with your hands. This time at the top, arms release forward to the mat coming into tabletop pose. Cat cows. On your next inhale, lower your belly and lift your heart. On the exhale, round through, hollowing out, lowering chin to chest, awakening our spine. Breathe in, ripple through your lower back, your mid back, upper back for cow pose, shining your heart. Exhalation, intentionally wave through your spine, rounding out, shoulder blades widening side to side, chin to chest. Breathe in as you find your neutral spine. We'll tuck all 10 toes and lift your hips to downward facing dog. Go ahead and walk your dog out, awakening the entire length of the backside of your legs. As you walk it out, keep those hips square. find stillness. Press up to your tippy toes, press your chest towards your thighs, and beginning at your tailbone, wave through your spine, coming into plank pose. And then using the muscles of your pelvic floor, lift those hips to down dog, and sink your heels to the earth. Again, lift to your tippy toes, yearn your chest through center, beginning at your tailbone, slowly ripple through your spine as you come into plank pose. Lift your hips up and back to down dog, Again, let's lift to your tippy toes, press chest to thighs, and ripple through your spine coming into plank pose. Good. Use the muscles of your pelvic floor to lift back up to down dog. Last one. This time from plank pose, lower your hips and lift your heart for an upward facing dog. Transition releasing tops of feet to the mat. And from here, we'll begin to shift your weight into your left palm. Begin stacking your hips and lower your left hip to the earth. Left palm aligned under your shoulder and we'll press down through those knuckles and fingertips to lift up. Side body stretch along your left side. Good. Now let's lower your right palm back to the mat, returning to our upward facing dog before we take it to the other side. Lower your right hip to the earth, stacking those hips. Right, right palm aligns under your shoulder. Feeling into that side body stretch on your right side. We 
We turn your left palm to the mat, heart shining bright. And use the muscles of your pelvic floor to lift head down dog. And lift your gaze to the front of the mat and step or hop to the front of the mat for a forward fold. Generous bend in your knees. We'll press down through all four corners to roll up. Sweep fingertips to the sky, palms kiss, and then dive it back down. Taking this two more in times, bend knees, roll up as you sweep your fingertips up. Finding your rhythm, palms kiss, and dive it down through center. Take this two to three more times on your own. Finding a nice little dance with your breath and movement. The next time you're lowered in forward fold, you may find a yoga block helpful for the next one, which I forgot, so I'm going to use Johnny Boy here. We will bring your right hand to the mat at the center, bend into your right knee, and on your exhale, extend your left fingertips to the sky, in intention of stacking your shoulders. On your inhale, lower your left hand to where your right was, Bend into the opposite knee before you exhale to extend your right fingertips to the sky. Feel good twist, getting even deeper into those hamstrings. We'll breathe in to lower and switch sides. Continue this on your own, finding your own feel good rhythm. Another yoga dance, mirroring your breath and the movement to get the most out of your time on the mat. Next time you lower at center, we'll breathe in to lift halfway. Exhalation, melt chest to thighs. And a big beautiful breath in, sweeping your fingertips up to the sky, saying good morning to this day. Palms kiss and then dive it back down through center. You can step or hop back to plank pose and take the flow of your body's choice, learning to cobra or taking chaturanga to upward facing dog. I'll meet you in down dog. Let's walk your palms to the back of the mat. Ensure feet are at hip distance. And then we'll breathe in, sliding your palms up, your legs flat back. Exhalation, sliding hands down, your legs drawing chest to thighs. Big beautiful breath in, circling your fingertips to the sky, cultivating vibes of your intention. Palms kiss and lower prayer to heart. With prayer at heart center, Begin to shift your weight into your left sole foot to draw your right knee up and then extend it out long, stepping forward. Inch your front foot forward as needed to lower your back knee to the mat. Keep your back toes tucked, thumbs to your sternum and sternum reaching up to your thumbs, lifting your heart. Connecting with this space as you sink your hips forward and down into the pose. Beautiful. With control, let's press up into high lunge, keeping your hands prayer at heart. Now slowly extend your arms out wide side to side, palms face up, and then draw them back in space as you lift your heart, mini back bend. Then draw your hands down, feeling your shoulder head soften down. Shoulder blades guiding down your back from here. We'll interlace your fingers behind your low back, draw them back and down, and on your exhale, bow forward. Interlace fingers reach up and overhead. Beautiful, my friends. On your next inhalation, press down through your front heel to lift up, interlace fingers, circle up and back, deep back bend, opening your heart. And then with control, we'll release circling fingertips to the sky, palms kissing and lowering to heart. Hands lower to frame your foot. We'll step back to plank pose and take the feel good flow of your body's choice. I'll meet you in downward facing dog.
Walk your palms to the back of the mat. Breathe in, lift halfway. Exhalation, melt chest to thighs. Big, beautiful breath in. Breathing in vibes of your intention as you circle your fingertips down around the mouth. Palms kiss and lower to heart. With prayer at heart, begin to shift your weight into your right solo foot to draw your left knee up and then extend your leg out long. Stepping forward, go ahead and inch that front foot forward as needed so you can lower your back knee to the mat. And we're ensuring that your front knee is in line with your ankle and not going past. Again, we'll keep those back toes tucked. Bring your thumbs to your sternum and reach your sternum up towards your thumbs, lifting your heart, connecting with this space, sinking your hips forward and down. With control, we'll press up to high lunge. And then slowly extend your arms out wide side to side, palms face up. Then draw them back in space as you lift your heart for a mini back bend. And then your hands draw down, feeling your shoulder head soften back and down, shoulder blades gliding down your back. From here, we'll interlace your fingers behind your low back. Draw them down and back, lifting your heart. Exhalation, bow forward. Interlace fingers, circle up and overhead. On your inhale, we'll press down through your front heel to lift up, interlace fingers, circle up and back, lifting your heart with control, release and circle fingertips to the sky. Palms kiss and we'll lower to prayer to heart, then lower hands to frame your foot. Step back to plank pose and this time everyone exhale to lower halfway for chaturanga. Big beautiful breath in for upward facing dog. And then we'll soften your legs to the mat and sit hips back to your heels. Open knees as wide as the mat, big toes kiss, walk your palms forward, more, melting your torso through center. Forehead grounds to the earth. And just begin to notice that wonderful world of you, the rhythm of your breath, your heartbeat. Noticing how with each breath you take, your heartbeat, your body, begins to find more stillness and peace. Let's walk your palms to the left side, taking a side body stretch. Right can stack on top of your left to deepen the stretch if you'd like, and then press through that right side body. Take it over to the right side, left palm can stack on top of your left as you press away through your left side body. Return to center. We'll slide your palms back towards your body, tuck chin to chest. Press down to round back in your spine. And then wave your spine, reaching your heart center forward. And we'll soften. Sit your feet off to one side to bring them out in front of you, making your way towards the center of the mat. Preparing for reverse plank pose. So legs extended out long. Bring palms behind you. We will press down through your knuckles and fingertips to press and lift your hips up towards the sky. Then on your exhalation, lower with control. Breathe in to sweep your fingertips to the sky. Exhalation, hinge forward over your extended legs, reaching towards your toes or wherever is accessible in your body. Slowly roll up, bring your soles of feet to the mat. Grasp along the back side of your thighs, breathe in fine length, nice flat back. Extend your arms out, palms face up. Lower belly firms up and in, and then we'll breathe in to lean back to one or two inches. Exhalation, draw navel to spine. Breathe in to lean back one or two more inches. Exhalation, navel to spine. Breathe in to lean back another one to two inches. Hold it. Then lean back another one to two inches. Hold it. Once more, lean back one to two inches, hold it, good work. Hold on to your legs to round back all the way to the earth. Hug knees into your chest, wrapping your arms around, head softens back. Option to take a slow rock side to side. Uh -huh. 
extend your right leg out long. Bring your right hand to the opposite knee, crossing it over your body into a feel-good releasing twist. Left arm extends out long, soft gaze to follow those fingertips. Let's bring everything back into center, hugging your left knee in before you extend it out long. Draw right knee into your chest, left hand to that knee to cross it over your body into the twist. Opposite fingertips extend out to the side. Gaze follows. We'll unwind, return to center, hugging your right knee in before you extend your leg out long. We're coming into Shavasana. Arms taking up as much space as you'd like. Getting all your wiggles and scratches out so you can settle into complete stillness, complete relaxation. Allow your body to just be here, your breath to just be, your mind to just be. Bring one sole foot to the mat and then the other. We'll roll over to your right side and take a smooth breath in and a complete exhalation out. Make your way to a comfortable cross-legged seated position, rolling those shoulder heads up and back, finding your beautiful, vibrant, long spine. Draw your attention inward, feeling into the effects of our practice. Take a big, beautiful breath in, sweeping your fingertips up to the sky, gathering vibes of your intention one last time. Palms kiss and bring it down to heart center. Bring one palm to your heart center and then the other, sealing the intention into your being. And let's take a moment to set an intention to allow the intention you cultivated with you on the mat to flow with you off the mat and into your day. Breathe in, raise prayer to your third eye. Exhalation, bow forward to your heart. Namaste. Good work this morning, my friend. I hope you enjoyed, feel amazing, and ready for your day. I would love to know what your intention was, so feel free to comment that below.